Hi everyone, this is Afin Ali. I pinned the video for a firefighting FM200 system and sprinkler system applied in basement floor. So I have to start from this C here. This is a huge plan. This is all firefighting system here, you know. So I have a one electrical room here. So the electrical room, as you know, we are using the CO2 system or fire uh, or FM200 system. So just I will tell you this telecommunication room. So there is a server room, there is a you say, computer and managing installation. So we have to provide to the drive system here. So you know if we put the water, uh, water sprinkler here in case of the fire. So this all computer or data, or data whatever this is installed here will be damaged by the water. So we using here to the FM200 system or Nova system or CO2 system. In this, in this project we using to the here. FM200 system so you can see here so FM200 system what is this FM200 system there is the powder dry powder will be uh, eliminate the fire in case of the fire so we provided two cylinders okay and this is one pipe will be like that and nozzle will be here so we have to test this this with the air pressure here we have to put the pressure up to the 7 bar or 8 bar as per an FPA and for two hours so if in two hours the pressure is the same so we have to say this is why there is no leakage if the pressure is dropped so we have to reject and we have to rectify this one so two hours we are taking the pressure for fm200 system so i will tell you this is nozzle this is in uh, two number of nozzle clean out agent cylinder see here two numbers of clean agent cylinder this thing like that and containing a 31 lps of FM200 system each one maintain the reserve so this is in case of the fire and uh, it will be it will be you know in case of the fire 68 temperature will be the burst of this and or you have to say this is why the smoke detector will be indicate this one and will be fire eliminated from this the gas system so this is telecommunication I will show you one more room here we have a electrical room see this is electrical room this is same in electrical equipment and generator we installed here in case of the fire in case of the fire so in case of the fire so we can we did, we will be eliminate the fire we cannot be installed to the fire sprinkler inside because this is all as well this is electrical room in case of the fire we installed to the uh, sprinkler of water it will be damaged the old age generator and all equipment like that so as per NFPA we are using to the FM200 system or CO2 system or the, because this is part of the drive system so see here this is also here number of clean of the agent of cylinder containing this one FM200 each and one this is this is same like that two cylinders we keep and one byte in the nozzles here 68 temperature or the fire indicator by the VMS system it will be on this and eliminate this fire so you have to understand this one there is a fire extension we keep here as well here this is only cylinder we keep here and this is like that so this is a fire system and you can see here this is a water supply uh, to the all all area this is parking area in basement so we using upright we have two type of the pregnant type and upright the fire structure we keep here this is a pregnant type or up type so we using upright because in those areas is the ceiling ceiling no ceiling inside is the upright we using here so this is uh, 3 by 4 so as per an FPA we have to distribute the sprinkler as per this is uh, 3 meter sorry 4 meter this is 3 meters because one NFP one sprinkler will be covered 12 square meters so you should have to know so it will be covered like that mm, this will be on like that will make the circle like that and make the circle like that and make the circle like that so all area so this is 3 meter this is 4 meter 12 square meter so as per NFP 13 we need a 12.3 square meter cover will be this one so this is first is 1 inch 1 inch 1 inch 1.4 inch like that so 1.8 inch 1 inch so i will start from here this is main pipe is coming down the for from the fire tank or fire, uh, fire pump room so this is coming here from this main pipe this is 6 inch dia from above going to the above this one so this is coming inside this but it is white line is a loop line we saying we provide a 4 4 inches loop this one
so this is our uh, this is a control uh, control wall packages installed here this is you can see the my other video we have we have already discussed in details this drainage system and this one and this is pressure and this is all the things available here what is the uh, uh, the all package units say this is all all you know control package units for fire fighting system so the fire extension they keep here fire extension this is going here this is small room mechanical this is without ceiling as well because known it for its value so here is a pump room where many things will be stored here for water supply or so we provide to the this is as this is as per nfp 4 meter 3 meter 12 square meter will cover this one 1 inch 1 inch and this is 1.14 inch and this is like that stall this one this is white light this is distributing here like that same same pattern this is same same will be same dye will be here same dye will be here same so we provide one we have typical and same typical so you see here this is i will tell you this is a dry system this is for dry riser this is for dry riser the semis connection will be connected with outside this is uh, house we pair so in case of the fire the fire truck will be connected with the semis connection of fire department and will be connected here and then come here inside the pipe and with the house and then will eliminate the fires so this is a dry system dry riser pipes for the this here gear we installing as well as as you know so this is loop system is going here you might see the loop system loop we provide a 4 inches loop so here this is going here this is 3 inch because we need also as well here so you see we go to the gate wall in the last so this is here see here this is going here so in the in the from the loop in two inch we provide to the firehouse cabinet firehouse cabinet need a two inch pipe minimum so firehouse cabinet we have to keep the fire fire extension here and firehouse cabinet there inside of the house pipe this is maximum 30 meter of length this as per an fps so this is one inch one inch this is a fire sprinkler stored here for extension we as well we keep here so this is same like that this is same like that this we keep here this is same like that same like that so this is same like that so this loop is going here see here this is distributing by the loop loop is a 4 inch fire extension here this is going here going here all pipes here this is fire extension you see firehouse cabinet here and this is pipe this is typical this is the same size as typical you know 1 inch 1 inch 1 1.4 inch 1 and half inch 1 and half inch and 2 inch this is like that this is uh, this is a uh, elevator lobby so we provide as soon as elevator lobby this is or maybe is a ceiling here so there is a ceiling area so we provide to the pendant type not upright so this is upright here this is pendant type so this is the left lobby area that's why see here see here this is loop area White line is coming here and going here. This is a front counter system, and this you can see here how distribute this one, how distribute this one, and this is also just covered in area. This four inch is more enough. This one area is this finish here. So hope you understand it this video and enjoy it. So this is a firefighting system for a typical for this is a very huge project and try to this one so this is just little bit a design data type for the production uh, system lobby other area maximum riser production area design area density hazards and type of the sprinklers maximum area of this sprinkler ordinary hazard groups one light hazards maximum distance of the sprinkler maximum minimum exposure of the star pressures the sprinklers temperature k factors all the things in the details you available here the sprinkler color code uh, stand for this so you can see here automatic weather sprinkler and this one is coming here so this is i show you this is we using here a sprinkler number of sprinkler system i told you this one is a 
upright is a 300 pendant time is 9 sideboard is 16 so 16 as well we are using a 16 so design for as a reference for NFPA 10, 13 and NFPA 14 so a spring clutch is we are using 300 for this also we are using this all you say this one pendant time uh, sorry uh, upright so all all upright or oh, is only here we are using this pendant type 16 like that and inside also we are using a pendant type not upright and this is here this is wall type I will tell you this is we have to understand the for side wall is being close so this is a main line is to each coming here so this is because this is a ramp area we don't need for here this is wall full side is being close you can see here wall top wall full side is being close so wall five singular using showing a in rank like that you know so see the detail in the google for uh, side wall sprinkler how, how the specification for this so this is a wall type sprinkler this is just saying the electrical room and this one is carbon or dice or type of the key if this one here portable fire extinguisher number of form of the gp house scheme of the allow launches of Strand by class 3 as this one, sprinkler plus this uncolored. Uh, this one is ordinary, uh, the factor is of uh, 5.65, is uh, typical as this using this video. So, so, hope you understand this video and enjoy this video. So, I uh, comment it if you have any comment regarding a fire party. So, uh, this is for me. I hope you will do this, you get knowledge for this. This is a for this, this drawing. If you have any comment, tell me. I will be right down. Kindly subscribe my channel. This is Afnia Deep. Bye bye.